Carter and Nina. Today is Friday, April 22nd, day two. Happy birthday to these people at a birthday this week. Today is Earth Day. Here is 10 tips on how to keep our Earth safe. Here are 10 tips to save the Earth. Avoid plastic disposals. Volunteer to clean up. Plant trees. Eat local. Recycle what you can. Don't drive alone. Carpool and take shorter routes. Take short showers. Unplug the devices. Reduce, reuse, recycle. This is this weekend's weather. Friday it's a high of 65 and sunny. Saturday it is a high of 59 and cloudy. And then on Sunday it is a high of 75, which is pretty hot and partly sunny. This this weekend's weather is bad. <laughs> Here's Andrew at the bottom of Comedy Club with the joke of the day. Knock knock. Who's there? I know. I know who? Me. Why are you gonna play me back? Funny as always, Andrew. Oh, come on. Here is the student lighthouse with an announcement. <laughs> Who's ready to have some fun? Do you like art, singing, dancing? Cornhole and outdoor activities and being creative? Well, this will be your day. Sharpen the Saw Day is taking place April 29th. See you there. Here's the leader and lead tip of the week. Headed to begin at the end of month. Plan ahead and set goals for yourself. Be prepared at all times and think about your actions and how they will affect your future. Think about the positivity and the negatives of your actions before you do it. Next week, habit is habit three. F put first things first. I'm sorry, girls, but you got bad grades. Maybe you should make a plan. Darn, that stinks. Maybe we should study a little bit more. Yeah, that's probably a good plan. <laughs> Madeline, I think we're ready to take our new test. Yeah. Here you go, girl. Good Thank luck. you. Here are grades, girls. Let's go, Clout. Oh, yeah. We did <laughs> so good. Making a plan really helped. Yeah. Making a plan to study definitely helped our grades, and yeah. I think everyone should do it. Yeah. <laughs> the whole school is very appreciative of all the sta staff, and we want to acknowledge one individual and with staff starting up. Today's staff shout out is for Mrs. Ryder. For those of you that don't know her, she is a school psychologist. Those of you who do know her know how awesome and amazing she is. She's important to both students and staff. Mrs. Ryder is always available to answer any of my questions and give me good, good advice. And I appreciate everything she does for me, for the staff, and for our students. She's kind and she is. and nice. Uh, she always puts others before herself and she always puts up with Mrs. Zern's shenanigans. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Mrs. Thanks, Ryder. Mrs. We are proud of all our fellow students who exhibit every day what it means to be a true leader. Let's talk to one of our leaders in this week's student spotlight.
This week, Sword to Roger ticket winner of this week is Jose. Jose, how did you win your Sword to Roger ticket? Um, I helped a kid when he was struggling in math. Uh, do you have any suggestions how to get a Sword to Roger ticket? Um, help people when they're struggling. Great job, we're very proud of you. This week, the Good Morning Bomber team was able to see behind the scenes of what the lunch ladies actually do. So let's take a look. I am here with one of the chefs at the cafeteria. What made you want to work here? Um, I've been working in food service for quite a long time. I went to school for it, and I like working with the kids, so that's why I wanted to come here. Next question. What's the hardest part about your job? <laughs> How many kids I have to cook for? <laughs> It's a lot of work. <laughs> um, how do you cook your food? Uh, well, we have an oven, so most of the stuff is cooked in the oven. We also have a steamer, so the vegetables and stuff like that go in the steamer. Okay, that's all of our questions for the chef. <laughs> Last week, one person in the classroom got a reward for being the most responsible. So congrats to those students. Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Remember, next week on Monday, we have PSSAs. So good luck to everyone on on the make make sure you not to stress out too much and get enough sleep the night before. Have a great day and weekend.